Oh, happy Friday, everybody. This is going to be an update of my 2023 Hobby Link International Speed Build. Uh, but I've also got a couple, well, I've got a few cards that have come in that I'd like to get out there and an update on my, like I said, the speed build here. And maybe if I got time, I'll do an up, show an update on the last year's Christmas Secret Santa build. So let's get to the cards here. Uh, start out with, yeah, this came from uh, Charlie's wife, Sue. As everybody should know by now, they uh, she makes not him, and uh, she she makes all her cards. Tammy used to do stuff like this. I wish she'd get back into it. But yeah, this one from uh, Charlie and Sue. Thank you all very much. Got here, I don't know, just a little bit before Christmas, but I wanted to get everything, you know, just in case others showed up. And here's one from uh, Rick, down throat modeling. Yeah, I got one kind of one kind of like this last year. Uh, let's see, let's see what I can do here with that. My hopefully my boy won't jump through the screen here. Yeah, that's the one I got last year from Rick, which is freaking awesome. That would be whoop, I get a finger out of the way, but anyway, that's, that's my uh, van that I did last year for the cancer awareness. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Let me pause this for a second. I think I screwed something up. There. That looks better. But yes, like I said, the other one that Rick did last year had my cancer awareness group build on. I thank you again there, Rick. I hope my car made it to you. Next one. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Well, this one's from Marcy. Uh, you should have mine by now. But yeah, this is from... Oh... Little Marcy over there. Good. Let's go, Modern Muse. I'm probably saying it wrong again. But anyway, that's Marcy. Thank you, girl. This one is from Dylan. Thank you there, Dylan. Over at NYS. Very happy about that. Awesome builder. Thank you again, sir. Hope mine made it to you, too. Uh, yeah, that's right. This one is from my buddy Vincent, Vince Weston. Cool, cool card. I like it. It's almost 3D-ish. There you go. Very nice. Thank you there, sir. Greatly appreciate it. And I even had a couple others come in. That's why I waited to do this. Uh, yeah, got a Christmas card from my mom in here. Oh, yep. Busy, couldn't make it over there. Was not expecting this, but yep, yeah. yeah, that's my mom. Yeah, it would be Cody hollering at me. Yeah, he'll probably jump through the screen here as well. Through the through that there in a second. Oh, yeah, this was the one that came in a day, which is understandable. I'm sure I've got some that just now showing up to sent it out over a week ago or two weeks ago. This is from my, our buddy, uh, got him going brain dead, Craig. Yeah, I think we're related. We got the same handwriting, I swear. We're both terrible. But it is what it is. But yeah, Craig Godfrey, uh, Mutt Mahler, to you, those that don't know his name. Yeah, I like that. That reminds me when I was a kid. I always had the stockings going. And I'm not sure if this one is a... Oh, yeah. This is a card, but this is, sorry about shaking around there, hopefully I'm not hurt, make anyone nauseous. I forgot, I meant to open this one up. This one is, yeah, this is from Dirk. Yeah, he put that in with my secret Santa gift. Again, I thank you, Dirk. And, yeah, my last video, I showed y'all what it was. What is that? Let's do this. It's just that tank right there. T-34-76, 1943 production model. Yep, Russian tank. Okay. I'll get building that sometime this year. And I can't remember if I did this in my one video. But yeah, I've got last year's uh, Secret Santa build is primed up. I will get to that as soon as I get done. 
with this. And this is my speed build for this year. I think it's Chris K. I could be wrong. I believe that Chris K sponsors this. Uh, again, before it was called the Kenny Can't Hang group build. But he did good last year. He he, uh, he completed his kit. So now it's a speed build. You get from the 26th to the 2nd of January to complete this build. I would have, if I would, you know, I don't know. I'm taking my time. I'm doing more on this little thing than I normally do. I've done some painting on the blue here. I've got a little scratched up, like, you know, a little battle damage. I don't know how good you all can see it. Uh, painted the thrusters on the bottom. Yeah, try to get it in there. There we go. A little better. Uh, I will be doing some uh, little panel lining where I can on this. Uh, I got the backpack going. Did a little bit more chrome in there. Uh, oh, yeah. Some more on here. I don't know how good that's going to show up. Oh, yeah, inside the little mini miniature thrusters. Usually on the master grade one, these flaps here move. They're separate, but this is a miniaturized. It's real grade. It's a miniaturized uh, master grade version. It's pretty detailed. Uh, I got these thrusters all chromed up. Uh, I don't know exactly where to remember what these are for, but I chromed the tips. And of course, Tammy just got farted on by Esther. Good girl. Uh, that's the back of the rocket launcher. Or, yeah. So, oh, yep. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Stuff falling down. When I got those, grab those cards. Uh, a little bit on the back part of the backpack. I did some more chrome in there. I've got some white paint I need to put in there. Oh, just a little bit of this and that. Uh, put chrome on where the eyes are. I'll be coloring the chrome over. With some clear, maybe red or blue. Uh, I don't know. One of those over there. So, yeah. I'm moving slowly with this. I think that's it. Uh, paint I'm using is just my Gundam markers. I've got the metallic ones and I've got the flat colored ones here. So, between that and that... Uh, some of these I'm using a toothpick instead of a tooth, uh, little paintbrush if I can help it. Uh, I've been using these for my battle damage scars. Just taking a little bit of the paint, just a little bit, and just scratching it across, across the chest there. You, yeah, if I can get the, yeah, you can see some of it there. I just, just take it and just dab it and just, you know, scratch it across. It does something. It helps. And of course when I flub up, I've got that to fall back on. So I'm not too far into it. I'm right... Yeah, right there right now. Yep, step five. There's not a lot left. Like I said, I've got the feet, the legs, the waist, torso, and chest is all done. I just got to do backpack area for right now and then it goes to the arms and then the head and then that weapons yes sir Who's ready? yep see i told you you'd come through yeah. <laughs> right here. Plate ready. Both all right as soon as i'm as soon as i'm done with the video i'll be out okay. all right see i told you people i knew he'd come through but anyway yep other than that i think that's it this thing only came with two four six Nine, if you want to count the body parts, ten sprues, yeah, two, yep, ten sprues. Uh, normal high grade, uh, which would be that bugger right there, that guy right there. He probably mine had six sprues, maybe seven at the most. So, yeah, these new ones are. Pretty detailed. That would be a good one for you, Jeff. Grab yourself a real grade. It's small, challenging, and even in your cluttered room like mine, you would have space for it. So, so yeah. Now you put some chrome and not chrome. 
a gray or something in there. You might be able to see something in there. And then, of course, these little dots here. I yellowed them up. They called for these stupid... I don't know what they do. They call these for these stupid stickers, and they never stay. They do not stay. They may stay for a little bit, and within a few days, they're, they're useless. They just peel right up. So that's why I'm not putting any... If I put any of the suckers on, it will probably be... Well, part of the, uh, I can't even see it now. But yeah, that's the closest thing right there. I need to put those on. I don't see a reason to put anything else on it. It just, it won't stay on. I, I, that's why I like the water slides. Water slides or the dry transfers. Those are useless. They're not strong enough to stay on. I might... I might put that on. It's hard for you to see. It's like a nomenclature. That might go on. Stuff like that I'll put on. But, where is it? This crap here. That there is supposed to go. Wait, is that what it was? No. Eh, one of those. Anyway, it was something like that. It was supposed to go where this yellow is, or yellow fans. I just took my Gundam marker. Old trusty yellow here. I painted it. You know, it was it was a lighter color. You see how light that is, and then you look at that, and it's a bit darker. Yeah, that's what it was before. I just said heck with it and painted it. I don't know. It's hard to see. But yeah, it's much better. Yeah. So, yep. I didn't need to take any paint out. These are more or less, in my opinion, they're more they're like paint markers, is what they are. And they don't take long to dry either. I know someone was, was it Ruben? Or one of you guys on a Hobby Link channel, uh, Discord channel, one was asking about how long these take to dry. I think five minutes maybe. Uh, of course, I've got my little portable heater here. Just enough to keep the temperature where it needs to be. It's not hot in here. It's just comfortable. But yeah, this here I could probably mess with right now. I think five minutes ago, so... Well, 10 minutes ago, according to uh, the timer right there. So, yeah. Sorry it babbled on, Charlie. But, yeah, probably be, probably be a few days before I do another video. I'm going to do my best to get this backpack done. I may get, to, may get the arms done tonight. Like I said, I'm taking my time on this. I know it's a speed build, but I'm having fun with this. So... Until then, I gotta get over and get we'll eat before the boy comes back through here. I do like how they've got this gun together. That's not normal. Usually, it's you got it's a two part weapon here, so y'all should try try to build one once. Uh, if you're unsure, go with the high grades. You know, it's just something to get your feet wet. And then, if you think you're good at it, go for the real grade. If you don't have the space for these large ones. If you don't have space for that, just go for a real grade. And those little guys there. Most of those are real grade. Those. Those are old. <laughs> yeah. Those are back in the late 90s, early 2000s ones. So, yeah, that was back when Toys R Us was selling them. But, yeah. Give it a try, people. You know. If you don't like it, you don't like it. If you like it, hey. Can't go wrong. They're pretty cool. Very... Like I said, these things are something else. Fun. Very articulated. Uh, except for the hands. I'm pretty sure. No, no, I'll take it back. This darn thing has uh, not all the fingers, but it's pretty nice. There you go. You got the hands that can move. Or, I'm pretty sure you're going to have to have ones in here somewhere to where... They can hold the weapon. But yeah. I'll show you all that when I get done with this thing. I've babbled on long enough. It's almost 15 minutes. I'm not going to hear the last words from Charlie or Jeff. But until then, y'all take care. Be safe. Uh, we did have a little bit of a snow shower this morning around 1030. And that was about it. It's, I don't know. It's down in the low 30s right now. Can't complain. The rain's already come through and done. So, I'm happy. Uh... 
going to get off here now. Again, uh, take care. Be safe. And next, when I have something else to show you all, I'll do another video. Till then, take care.